Ladies and gentlemen, it is episode 13 of the 2K24 My Rise. We left off uh, uh, from last week's episode where we had to recruit some members for the War Games uh, match for SmackDown side. I ended up recruiting Stone Cold Steve Austin and Randy Orton. So right now... We uh we also then went ahead and invaded Raw. So let's take a look at here right now. Uh, Team Raw, uh, William Regal tweeting: Team Raw doesn't invade and sneak attack like cowards. So I'm sending AJ Styles to SmackDown for a War Games preview match. We'll step up and face him. So you got my little message. The Miz responds. We'll get back to you on that challenge. All right. Uh, let's check the social medias. So we got uh, Grayson Waller complaining about his lost, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. KO is not happy about me cho choosing uh, Randy and Austin. The Miz trying to convince me to pick uh, Logan Paul, but that didn't happen. We got another. Uh, oh, we got a lot of them. Oh, geez. Okay, so there we go. It's, uh, yeah, well. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to definitely spend all those points. Okay, we're going to clear those notifications. We're going to talk to the little pipsqueak, Troy Simpkin. We did what Miz asked, and honestly, it didn't turn out that great. I never wanted to assault William Regal. What? do you mean it was must see tv especially the part when you nailed regal good stuff pal yeah i'm not too happy about neil uh pummeling regal whatever 
So what does our genius GM have planned next? And where is he even? I haven't seen him anywhere since I got to the building. Well, with um, tensions escalating and who knows how Rob would retaliate, Miz thought it was better if he stayed home this week. So, he ran away again. Got it. All right, so the Miz is hiding at home like a little chicken. What's more important is Regal is sending AJ Styles here for a War Games preview match. And Miz has so much confidence in his team captain that he wants you to decide who should fight Styles. Okay, and you want my decision now? Yes. And Miz also said if you make the wrong call and we lose, then it's completely on you. So choose wisely. Uh, I'm going to go. Uh, I'll do I'll do AJ. I'll let the boss know. Let's go. All right, so AJ's making his way to the ring for his matchup against me. Here I come. All right, bell sounds in. We are underway. Oh, AJ, AJ ducking that clothesline already right off the bat. But he gets caught in the night with a splash. Yeah, the match is uh, hammering away right now. Can't wait! To, I can't wait to play the game. Really can't wait to do it. Okay, I did see AJ over the top, but I guess that's what's happening. Oh, missed the elbow. All right, into the crowd, back out of the crowd we go. And there's that stomp. <laughs> Just continuing the, the punishment on AJ Styles here. A low, oh, nope, stopped. Yeah, I'm just gonna kick you over the top rope and Connect with a suicide dive. Throw you back in that ring. Oh, my stamina is going down, so I got to watch myself a little bit here. Just got to pace myself. Oh, AJ rolling me over, trying to pummel me. It ain't happening, AJ. It ain't happening. I'm drilling my knee into the ground or my foot into the mat. And again. Uh -oh, look 
Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, I was waiting for that. Uh, oh, he's got me in a pin. He's going to pin me. No, he isn't. Not today, AJ Styles. Ah. Uh, AJ, if you think you're so smart doing that, you'd you'd be yeah, you'd be trying to attack me. <laughs> Instead, you had to miss. Oh, AJ trying to he's really trying to take advantage here. Oh, reversal. Close line you back over that top rope. And oh geez, where the heck was I diving to? Catch you with that elbow. Just pummel. Shades of Dusty with those elbows, my man. AJ uh, making that a habit of rolling outside the ring. And a boot to the back for good measure. Just keep hammering away on you. Oh. I thought I was going for that my uh, pile driver. Oh, right into the crossface. <laughs> and <laughs> right back to those elbows to the top of the head here. Trying to catch him with that elbow. And but I caught him with the dusty elbows yet again. I keep hitting that maneuver. And caught him with the choke slam. Gonna put the icing on the cake here. It's over, AJ. Oh. Oh, AJ, 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 you got moves, eh? I think that was his resiliency he used anyways. That's okay, AJ. It's over. Oh, Jesus. He, he, he just does not want to give up. He does not want to give up at all. Does he want to give up? Now, here's your winner, Brutus. Yes, he does. With another victory, will you listen to the ovation from these Hammond fans? How can they love this guy so much? If I know Styles, he'll be going over this match tape later on and reevaluating his strategy. Yeah, we can't get AJ out just yet. 
No, no, you really can't count AJ out, but. Can't count me out either. All right, Finn, what have you got to say, brother? We got to win against AJ, but War Games is going to be a whole lot tougher. With you and the rest of the crew we have, I like our chances. Same. Although I do wish we weren't fighting on Miz's behalf. I hear you, but it's bigger than that. So how about we win the match, then we'll work on getting our house in order. Deal. All right, so I think we're going right to war games. Here we go. It's war games time. Two teams will be contained in separate cages. So our United States champion, AJ Styles, is going to be starting off this matchup. But with who? Me. Oh, yeah. Me and AJ getting things started here. And AJ catching me right away, learning from, uh, you know, what I did to him in the last match. Okay, so Looks like there's uh there's uh things to achieve in this match, so Right now, I'm just going to beat up AJ until the thing that I need to do, which is strike Cody in the middle of the ring, happens. All right, so Finn Balor is going to be making his way to the ring next. I guess I won the advantage in that... Uh, 
in that triple or that match against uh, AJ Styles. It wasn't a triple threat match, but. Beautiful back body drop. Oh, look at that Finn already looking. He's looking for some weaponry. Oops, I hit the wrong button. I didn't want to recover early and lose. Uh, oh. All right, now Finn coming in to give me a hand here. Luke Gallus on the other side on his way uh, into the ring. Lord knows AJ needs the help right now. And Gallo's uh, taking uh, some kind of a cross-body maneuver from me. Just waiting on Cody to get, get in that ring. Which, by the way, um, Cody does not have another partner. So Cody is coming in next for his team. Oh, oh, catching me with that uh, flipping DDT. I can't remember the name of the maneuver. Oh, he's got me in the calf crusher now. I'm in trouble. I'm a bit in trouble. No, no, no. AJ. All right, AJ sending me into the other ring. But Stone Cold is uh, making his way to the ring. AJ trying to reverse my choke slam. Austin, I could use your help over here. All right, now pummeling on Luke Gallows for a little bit. Carl Anderson, eh? I don't... Oh, he is up there. Okay. I thought Carl Anderson was... Uh, I thought they were doing an angle where we took Carl... Where Anderson was down with an injury.
But right now we got ourselves what looks to be a pretty even uh, playing field here. I'm just waiting for uh, Cody's uh, thing. I'm going to pause it for just a second here. Okay, in the left ring. So not the ring that I'm in right now. Not the ring that AJ and uh, Luke Gallus are going to be double teaming me in unless Finn Balor uh, makes it over, which he is. Oh, no, Styles Flash. I don't know what AJ's thinking I'm doing. Oh, I reversed. I was trying to get up. Oh, Orton. Okay. Just decked him. All right, big boy. You're going up. You're going for a ride. There you go. Can't even really see what I'm doing right now. But I'm gonna go help Austin because I do not like what Carl Anderson is doing to Austin. Oh. Hey, Carl, Carl. Let me let me up. Okay, we got Cody coming. We got Cody coming. I have to get up like right now. Get up. There we go. Oh, Cody, get in the ring, damn it. I just want to get this goal. It's all I want to do. Thank you, Cody. And now everyone is brawling in the ring. We've got the storyline going on. It's me and Cody in the one ring battling it out. Oh, he got me in the crossroads. Ooh, I have. <laughs> I'm taking the loss on this war games. This is not good for me. Not good for me at all. Until then, this is Team Raw, the American Nightmare Night, to stand tall over WWE. Yeah, Team Raw defeating Team SmackDown. Uh, we're going to see how that plays out now.
But I unlocked the, the Raw and SmackDown uh, t-shirts. All right. So Cody furthers the story. We've got uh, uh, some fans here or some people here who want me to do something. Okay, Geneva Rose wants me to beat up someone. Listen, I know you're dealing with a lot of pressure right now after war games. It's overwhelming. And it can make you forget why you stepped into this business with a heart full of passion. Trust me, I get it. But picture this, a match after hours at TBD when the arena is deserted and all eyes are off you. No obligations to live up to anyone's expectations, no titles to defend, just you and a ring, pins only, back to the core of wrestling. Okay. I mean, I'm accepting it because, um, you know, want to wrestle, but all right. All right, just here we go. El Ordinario, that's who I am beating up. Irish whip, clothesline. Kind of a, this is kind of a bit of a, a lull after war games. Jeez. All right, catching me with that back elbow. Let's see what you got to do here. All right, bringing in a weapon. Don't want to do that to you. Choke slam. Up you go. Down you go. Jackknife coming for you too, buddy. Can you? It's over. Bit uh, kind of pointless, but it at least raises my stats.
Okay, well, I got that. And uh, what's next here? This person wants something. This championship run is epic! You must be so stressed. I'm stressed vicariously through you. You know what helps me relax? I like to go on vacation. In my mind. Here's what I'm thinking. Close your eyes, take yourself somewhere exotic, and imagine yourself doing the most exciting thing you can think of. Which, for me, is wrestling. But against someone fun, like, what about Doink the Clown? Want to see where your mind can take you? All right. I guess I'm going to Mexico to fight Doink the Clown. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Yeah, here he comes. Here comes Doink. This is going to be interesting. All right. Just keep pummeling him. Just keep hammering away on him. Irish whip to doink. Throw him in the corner. Um, catch him with that. Catch him with a splash. Pulling pile driver. Come on. There, that's the move I was trying to do, but clearly Doink uh, woke up just in time to reverse that. <laughs> Yank your uh, butt back outside. And Irish whip. Oh, caught me with that knee there. Doink the Wily Veteran in this one. But, oh, I just made him bleed. Oh, Doink. Oh, Doink brawling right back with me. Oh, oh. I think he was trying to bite me and then, yeah, slinging me off the ropes there. Oh, Doink's going up top. What is he looking to do? A whole lot of nothing. And here we go. Ch uh, another ja uh, jackknife powerbomb coming up. 
Yeah, we reversed it. Back body drop. Catch him with the roll up. See if I can beat him there. I got him. Okay, so that uh, that's that. Uh, let's check. Uh, I got. I probably got some attribute upgrades to take care of. Yeah, I've got two of them that I can afford to do. Social media. Let's see if there's anything storyline wise on socials. Okay. Wait, what did Roman say? Okay. Cody, what do you want, man? What are you doing here? Slow down there, Tiger. Don't get hot. This isn't an invasion. Then what are you doing at my show? Do they not have gyms at Raw? I'm here with news. Because I wanted to tell you man to man and not have you beat it on social media. To think I could have continued to live in blissful ignorance. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but after I beat you at Survivor Series, Miz and Regal are giving the WWE Universe what it wants. You and me. Title versus title at the Royal Rumble. That's actually good news. Thanks. Honestly, you could have slid into my DMs to let me know. Miz asked me to come to SmackDown. He made an additional proposition. Let me guess. The WWE Universal Champion and the World Heavyweight Champion in a tag team match for the first time ever. And it's going to be awesome. He tell you already? Guy learned at the feet of Teddy Long. So what? We obviously both like gold. You ready to team up? You know what? Hell with it. I'm in. I knew you wouldn't resist the opportunity. Go team. All right. So uh, me and Cody going into an angle. I can get behind this. Looks like we're taking on the Viking Raiders. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring, accompanied by Bob Hart. the man 
is blazing his track through it. All right, here I come. All right, let's go. Bell's about to sound. Here we go. Bell's. Damage the Viking Raiders as Cody. Okay. Would you screw off, Eric? Eric. Eric. Stop it. Yeah, go tag Ivar. I'm going to go tag Cody. Oh, oh, I don't like that. And down you go. Ha ha. Just gonna. No. There you go. Close on that. Just keep hammering away on him. Okay, that's done. Win the match by pinfall with Cody Rhodes. Okay. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Ivar. Ivar is trying to mount a comeback. All right, trying to look for the crossroads. I don't know what uh, Valhalla is doing. But I just hit the crossroads on Ivar, and now Eric. Eric is uh, down, or Eric cannot come back in now. Oh, he just took my head off. I don't know if I were you, Ivar, I'd be looking to tag out instead of beating me up. And that's exactly what he is going to do. I'll just stomp the back of your head. I do think I'm getting another crossroads a lot sooner than I will be getting the pedigree. So I'm just going to do what I can to keep keep Eric mad on the mat here. Okay, I need to stop being distracted. That would be nice.
Just trying to get this match won, that's all. So myself and Cody Rhodes. So Cody Rhodes takes the pinfall victory in this one. Got to see where this is going now. All right, so it looks like uh, Ridge Holland and Butch, SmackDown Tag Team Champions, won a match with myself and Cody Rhodes. Okay, just, uh, hey, okay, like, okay, stop. I don't need to see all the socials from the past. I accidentally clicked on that one. Yeah, okay, I've already seen all those ones. But ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank you all for tuning in here. But if you want to, if you want to find uh, some more of our shows here, take a look at this. You can find all of those shows under the Turnbuckle Studios brand and the Chris Parrish brand. Uh, if you want to follow me at my socials, you can look at me up at YouTube.com at CBRS Entertainment, uh, Twitch.tv, CBRS underscore entertainment, threads.net at CBestFilms83, Facebook.com, Chris.best83, TikTok.com, CBRS.entertainment. Um, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, this was uh, War Games and an Unlikely Partner. That's, uh, I think that's what I'm going to go with uh, this episode. Um, I'd like to thank you all for tuning in. It was an awesome episode. Have yourself a wonderful have yourself a wonderful rest of your day, folks.
we say yeah.